And welcome back to the long run where we are about to finish Legend of Legaia. We've made it through the bio castle. Everyone has a full set of Ross Arrow gear. There's only one thing left to do. Let's face our destiny. Hey! I feel a breeze! There's a breeze coming from over there! What's that? Ah! Wah! What's wrong, Noah? What are you shouting about? Holy... You! Alright, Gala! Please don't let go! I'm trying, but my hands... I can't get a good grip. We're slipping! Whoa! Well, we're dead. <laughs> That's how the game ends. So thank y'all for watching. Oh, here we go. Huh? I felt this feeling before. Noah, where do you think you're going on your own? Vaughn, we have to follow Noah. My brother, he's alive. Just as Sungi said, Cortez fused with Juggernaut and is still alive. But, how horrifying, how bizarre, he couldn't be human anymore. No, no, stop, stop it! Cord, come back. Turn into a person again. Why'd you do it? You're my brother. You're supposed to be human. <laughs> you know, all those things that brothers do, such as eat hot chip and be human. I'm a human. I know about love. I am human. I hate being alone. It's good to be human, so Cord, be human again. are dirty. I gave up being human to become a mighty being. I am a being that transcends humans, even the Seru, a perfect entity. Perfect entity! Perfect entity! Humans are imperfect. I will use all my powers to destroy them. No, you're wrong, Kor. Who interferes? It's me, Noah. Noah? Who is Noah? I know no Noah. I need no Noah. Noah, are you alright? Court. I sense the presence of humans 
weak, dirty humans. I do not need humans. I must destroy the humans here. I must put down a save state just in case. Because, just so we don't have to go through that entire cutscene again. Oh, that's fancy. We're fighting nothing? Oh. Oh. Hey, buddy. You're a big boy, aren't you? Boy, he's a big spoon, all right. Ooh, things are getting, uh, things are getting weird. All right, we're going to use a, I'm going to start by using a shield elixir on the Well, there goes that shield elixir. <laughs> we might be in trouble, guys. Just a little bit, especially considering we can't see Vaughn's face. And again, basic attacks. Okay, obviously this is serious business. You're going to do Spoon, you're going to cast Terra, you're going to cast Ozma. And we'll have, we'll have Vaughn do meta next turn. Right now we just need to make sure everyone doesn't die. And I feel like I need to point out this is the first damage that we're doing to court. Well, that was fancy. Oh, Gala just barely survived that. Just a good thing that he did because he's casting Ozma. This court, not Kurt. Just straight up dance party up in here. Oh, 
Oh, but that cost a lot of magic. Like, how much is it? 240. Okay. We're only casting these once. Uh, you're going to use that. And then you're going to use a magic fruit on one. You're basically just casting them to see them at this point because these are like... These are the strongest attacks that an average player is going to see in this game. Well, maybe a little above average. You need to still like actively go out and get these spells. survive that, but she didn't survive the attack when she had the shield elixir on. I don't have any more shield elixirs. just for good measure. So basically Final Fantasy VIII Guardian forces. You're not wrong. Okay, um, you spirit up. You no longer need to spirit up. You can go nuts. And I'm just gonna have you on healing for duty. And in the worst case, oh that that did even that did even more damage. That did more damage than the uh, the ultra sun basically. That's hilarious. Uh, let's have you use, I think, uh, yeah. uh, nope, not auto. You just get to use Miracle Arts every turn, and that is what you shall do. about the same amount of damage. This song's pretty bad though. Um, 
this turn I'm gonna have you use orb. I'm going to... You're just gonna do this forever. And, um... Are you spirited up? Yes, you are. Well, let's load you up with an attack and maybe you'll get- you'll even get a counter. I am a little worried though, because, uh, Hort has yet to, you know, perform any big attacks. Good, you have a warning sign. So basically, guess what happens if we don't spirit with everyone this turn? <laughs> Whoever is not spirited will freaking die. Uh, that's still packed the punch, but uh, it could have been a lot worse. Like, we, we cast Spoon here and we'll be good. Uh, so, yeah, you keep doing that. You don't have. Oh man, you're just a couple of points away. How is your Vera? Level 9. I don't know why I bothered to do Vera. I could have just as easily done Spirit. But at the very least, if Gala gets attacked this turn, he'll be able to heal himself. But yes, a level 9 heal will always, uh, will also grant you additional arc points. There we go. He's attacking Gala. And so Gala will get to heal himself now. It's all according to plan. Although that didn't do a whole lot of healing, let's be real. Um, for good measure, I'm gonna throw a healing barrier away. And everyone else, load up mirror ports. Good chunk of damage though. Here comes Ultra Charge. Mm -hmm. 
Nothing other, nothing to do other than just steer it up with everyone here. Because here comes Final Crisis yet again. Electro Trash. Sounds like a music genre. An interesting music genre. Okay, obviously, we're casting Spoon. You're going nuts. Exercising your God given right to go nuts. And, um, what do I do with you? I can't miracle art just yet. Now, just Spirit again. It super annoys me, the fact that, uh... Like, the first turn, Noah was taken down, and she had a, a shield elixir up. Which took away the shield elixir. And now Court can't do it again. <laughs> Like, it's almost like the shield elixir had a negative effect. I, I have no other explanation for it. Also, it feels real good to be able to do this every turn. for this. Hopefully I'll survive. Um, hopefully I'll survive a, lit a literal freaking planet crashing into my face. What is this? Well, no I didn't, but everyone else did, so I guess that's the thing. Yeah, that was just a literal meteor from Final Fantasy Seven. Okay. You're gonna do Spoon, you're going to do Phoenix. That has more forks, more forks than spoons. Yes. Okay. 
Um, you do spoon again. You're going to use a fury use on yourself. And uh, you... Spirit. I kind of have to question why this enemy is called why this uh, series is called Spoon. I think someone was a little too much into the tick. Feeling very in yourself, you exercise your god-given right to go nuts. And uh, you're also gonna load up a miracle arc just in case Court decides to attack you. So, are we gonna be able to make it through this without using the point card? Are we gonna be able to finish this with the entire bank of 69,420 points? The answer is yes, because we won. So you want to know the funny thing? Our point card had more had more points on it than court had hit points. We still would have had to use it seven times, but we could have just tank through with the point card. Noah, I know how you must feel. We all did the best we could. Now the human world will return to normal. However, Hari did the best he could, but I think Noaru Valley is done for. The age of Seru. Our era is over. We are now just we are now just part of the collective memory known as history. That's a very poetic way of saying we're, we're dead. But at least we did something. It's a little sad, isn't it? Also, you can't tell me that Ozma doesn't look like the friggin' Ocarina of Time. No! Tara, don't leave me alone! Don't leave me! Noah, your parents were killed by Seru, yet you want to be with me, a Seru. And besides, you're not alone. You have Vaughn and Gala. Ozma, we have experienced life and death together. How can you leave me now? Oh, Gala, has your dependence on me caused you to forget your own abilities? Vaughn, probably saying something. Vaughn, your heart is so full of warmth. Thank you, Vaughn. Thank you, Noah. Thank you, Gala. Together we humans and Sarah were stronger than even the ancient Tieg himself. We are now heading beyond the twilight, but do not forget this. Humans and Sarah are both born of Tieg and are one. They have lived through the same era. It is time for humans to create their own futures. <laughs> Good talk, Ron.
This is the last of our seven powers. Bon, always the one with the deep level please, so deep that we can't hear them. That's all, she was just getting a deep skin treatment. That was, that was the plot of the entire game the entire time. So, so that May could, uh, could get that uh, extreme spa treatment. Thus did the brave deeds of our three, uh, three heroes defeat... Uh, Thus did the brave deeds of our he three heroes defeat Juggernaut, who had engulfed Rebellion. That's a weird way to put it. And brought to humankind a new world of true peace, completely free of the mist. Children of Vermil, be proud of Vaughn, whose home is our village. Be careful. Oh, you again. Oh no, how unfortunate. What a terrible blunder. I have a sore and take me all the way here. Only to find that the biggest hero of Vaughn is about to leave. Who is that person? Ah no. I am tremendously disappointed. Now people are so cold, danger past God forgotten, the world is a heartless place. Well, and it is me, Dr. Usha. Have you learned how to count? I'll never let you live that down. I gave you my knowledge in the time-space bombs when you came to Crystal Kingdom. Come closer and get a good look at my face. Now there, do you remember now? Nah. <laughs> you literally but thou must. Okay, fine. Well, never mind that. <laughs> God damn it. Vaughn, I want to I want you to tell me why you are leaving. What? No. no. Like, the, the game has solidly set up that it's Vaughn and May. My true feelings for Noah is we're best of friends, okay? Let, let's, uh... We, we have seen the world as it was with the mist. Let's see what wonders await when the mist is not a factor. I see. Just what I was expecting of you, Vaughn. You wish to see the fruits of your efforts. <laughs> yes, well, if those are your intentions, then that's fine with me. Here's what I'll do. I'm going to write a book about the life of our great liberator. I will remain in Grimelm. Grimelm? I will remain in Grimelm to grab to... Adding R's everywhere. I like adding letters. AK, I need a vacation. I will remain in Rivelm to gather material for my book until you return, Vaughn. Those two here, they must be your family, Vaughn? 
Pardon me for disturbing you saying farewell to Vaughn. Tell me think, tell me everything outside. What a char what a character you are, Dr. Usha. <laughs> Very well, I will tell you what you want to know. I won't wait to see you off, Vaughn, so take care of yourself. I'm sure you'll be alright anyway, but take care anyway. Uh, I'm sure you'll be alright, but take care anyway. Good luck! One would think that I could interact with the tree, and it's like the warmth that the Genesis tree had is no longer present. Yeah, of course I will. Apparently there's a little bit of rebuilding that needs to happen now. But uh, no more wall, just defense. Um, so you want to go see the world now that the mist is gone? I want to see the world too. I want to go with you. Take me with you. Yeah, alright. Thank you. This is the day I've been waiting for. The day that we finally get to travel together. I don't need to get ready. I'm ready to leave right now. You're going inside your house to get all of your things. You don't have much of a house right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so excited. Is she in our party? Oh, we don't. We straight up do not get a menu. Been a month already. How time flies. Vaughn, well, you're an excellent student. I'm proud to have, taught, to have taught you the martial arts of fighting. Although you appear to have also learned the martial arts of point card, and I don't particularly appreciate the fact that you use that thing on me. I'll be praying for your safety. Anything over here? Well, the, your hair appears to be clipping through the uh, through the ground there. Oh, do you remember when you promised to travel with me someday? Uh, uh... <laughs> yes? Well, I'm only teasing, Ron. Don't worry about it. <sighs> I mean, I wouldn't mind it having a little more company, you know? I am sure. We're, we're, we're gonna be going everywhere, so you know. So what you're saying is... We're all going to live forever. But not you. You are here. Sure, why not? Let's get, let's get the, uh, let's get the lowdown. First of all, you do know that no more Sarah will be created anymore, yes? Our good friends are in Seoul are still experimenting, but it's no use. With Urumai is destroyed and Seru Kai gone, no new Seru will, Seru will ever appear again. What's more, the Seru already here are gradually losing their power. My calculations show that most of the Seru will die off in the next year or so. We avoided the Seru in the Age of the Mist, but losing them completely is another matter. The Sorn, the Flying Carts, and others who, rely, who relied on the Seru may return to the Stone Age. But Vaughn, I have faith in human potential. The human race will never die out as long as we have people like you to carry on T8's wishes. I'm sure she is. Did ya? Awesome. We build new Ramel with our own hands. Building houses is hard work, but it feels great. Our own hands and some bricks. Maybe we gotta get used to not using Seru. Yeah, 
have by the time we have grandkids and Sarah will be just the stuff of fairy tales and bedtime stories. Oh right. Huh? We're gonna have to destroy this place before. Nothing ever nothing like that would ever happen again, right? Build it strong just in case. That's a pretty funny joke. By the time you get back, the village will look so good you won't even recognize it. Fine. When you were young, I used to tell you all about it, what the world was like before the mist came. But now you know far more about the outside world than I do. I've got a new lease on life now, though, so I'm going to learn as much as I can. Go in there, looks like you know. Good to see you again, Mom. I brought Dr. Usha here. You may have heard already, but the Seru are gradually losing their power. Soon the Soren Seru wings will also be useless. Will you be alright? I appreciate your concern, but don't worry. Our Elder and the rest of the Soren have made an important decision. We've decided to live on the surface as ordinary humans, not, well, not like you have a choice. My younger brother, Rentas, will have much to teach us about how to live as service workers. Also, like, I wonder how Soul is powered. Cause if it had anything to do with Sarah, well. Hmm. Who the hell are you? Disco King? Let's let's cool moves. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, that we. Well, that sucks. I guess we just will never know what uh, we had to say. Sure, let's have a bite. Come on, eat the hot, the hearts, the heart stew, the hot stew. We're back up to full health. Butterflies. Chase the butterflies. Can we save? I guess not. Memory statue is silent and must have lost all of its power. I guess that's how you're gonna justify that. Anyway, that's everyone. Hello, Ron. So are you ready to leave? Well, I have something to ask you. After the village was rescued from Juggernaut and Noah left the village, Noah was carrying a baby, wasn't she? Noah refused to tell me who the baby was, but that was her brother Cole, wasn't it? I the, the, I didn't notice that she was carrying a baby. I, I assume you mean in her arms. Because it, there's no way that Anyway, uh, I don't know. If you don't want to talk about it, I understand. Just forget the whole thing. Cole too must have been reborn when we received new life from the Rossi. I know that it was Cole who brought the mist into the world. And I also know that Cole is Noah's only blood relative. No, but must have been trying to leave with Colt unnoticed. But I noticed her, so poo poo on her. She must have decided to raise Colt by herself. Noah's quite a young woman. Hmm. Ron, are you about to leave Rimmel? Sorry, decision that will end the game. Yes. Have you said your goodbye to everyone in Rimmel? Sorry, decision that will actually end the game. Yes. Good luck to you. See the distant lands, the rich world for all humans. Vaughn! Vaughn, Vaughn, goodbye Vaughn, we'll miss you. Good luck, take care, we'll be waiting for you. Remember this is your home. All 
Are you sure? Yes. Pretty sure? Yes. Absolutely sure? Yes! And off they go. Out into the world. To explore it. Without having to worry about the mist or the Seru. That's it. We have beaten Legend of the Gaia. There's still some things that could be done, but um, I'm good. They can enjoy these scenes. Pretty much all places that we've already been. So there is Baby Court, I guess. So, let's get some thoughts on the game. I have finished, I think this is probably the third time that I've finished this game. Um, we used to rent the absolute crap out of this as kids. Um, yeah, helped by the fact that, you know, with a PlayStation, you have memory cards. So you didn't have to worry about having to return the game to the rental store and then renting it again next weekend, only to find out that your game is gone. <laughs> because that was a big thing with, you know, especially Super Nintendo games. But um, yeah, we got to continue our game. We it took us a long time to, to actually get through it, but we eventually did it, and it's, it's just a super fun game. Like it's not the most polished thing in the world. <laughs> you destroyed the mist with a Y. Thank you for the bit, Zero. Um. But yeah, I'm. I mean, th this game just brings back some fun memories of my childhood, and I'm just really happy to have been able to play this game again and share it with you guys. And I hope that you enjoy it too. I I know that a couple of you have been like curious about this game, and never actually got around to playing it well even though you've seen the entire thing again you haven't really seen the entire thing there are some more things that i could have done um and i would absolutely recommend um anyone watching this um you know playing through this game themselves and just finding all of the secrets out there because just a really good game with a really interesting battle system. Um, there is a Lagaya 2. Uh, that one was for the PS2. I never had a PS2. My cousin did, but uh, I like the PlayStation 1 was the only system that I got, like, that was new that I actually got, like. That was Nintendo. But since then I've always got Nintendo systems. Um, I do intend on playing Ligaya 2 Dual Saga for Let's Play the World Live. Obviously we're not playing it next. Aside from the fact that we have a request lined up, I want to play something else. Um, and I already have um two options set up for voting we're not going to vote on that yet because we like i said we do have a request to go through before uh we get to our next scheduled game um let me get that request because i forget the name of it Let's see. Programs. Ah. Uh, so the next game that we're going to play is The Longest Journey. Uh, it was requested by Mazzy on behalf of Foos. Uh, it's a game that uh, Foos is more familiar with. And um, I know literally nothing about it. Uh, I was gifted this game by Foos. Um, I'm gonna 
discover it together. And I will I will say right now, wink sink. It's gonna be real good for the longest journey, I feel. Like given the type of game that we played and the fact that I have never seen anything about the longest journey before. I'm going to be trying to keep some things to myself, and Wink Sync is how you get them out of me. As well as an analysis of like what's going on. Like this game is I was already familiar with it, so it didn't work as well. But I I definitely gave it a try whenever uh, Jewel redeemed it. Uh, so yeah. Other than that. That is going to do it for, for this stream once we're done with these credits. The next schedule's... Ah! I mean no users today. I think my thing glitched out. But, um... Thank you to Zero Tyrion, J-Pop, for hanging out tonight. Uh, thanks to Mazzy, Foos, Jewel, um, Senguy. Everyone who uh, who came out to uh, to watch this over the course of its run. Uh, the next scheduled stream is going to be on Sunday at 8 p.m. or later Atlantic Daylight Time. It is the Sunday Super Shuffle. We're going to do some Archipelago shenanigans. Maybe with the new version, but we'll see what happens. It depends on whether there's still some bugs to fix or not. Because it's still in release candidate. Um, that takes us around the week, around the wheel, to our next long run stream next Tuesday at 9 p.m. where we're going to start on the longest journey. Uh, and I'm also going to be doing a uh, safe mode stream sometime this week. I know I keep saying that I want to do one and then end up not. But um, this time I have a more uh, attainable goal. <laughs> Uh, once I finish making that uh, MSU one pack for um, like that Final Fantasy Tactics MSU one pack for Link to the Past, I'm going to be doing a test run of it, um, so y'all can get uh, yeah get an impression of um, the music that I put in and. Um, if you have any suggestions on substitutions, things like that, that'd be your opportunity. Yes, J-Pop. Like I, like I said uh, earlier, unfortunately you weren't here for it, but I made a music pack of Final Fantasy Tactics for A Link to the Past. So you get to listen to the to the Final Fantasy Tactics music while playing Link to the Past. And I gave everyone a, a taste of that during the first break, but unfortunately you're a bit late. <laughs> Flower. Yeah. Ah, that was a good game. Alrighty. Well, I've already said what I need to say. So thank you all so much for watching and for following me through this adventure. I'm cool you if you don't know. And I'll see you guys next game.